वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्तबिंद श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंदसोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सामुक्त बिंदन मनोहर वाछाकल्पतरुवश के पास सिंधु व्यवच पतिन पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुखति वाचाल पंगुंगिरी यत्कि पातमहंग वंदे परमानंदमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्तिपदे देवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नर चरतम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मधुर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्रश प्रकाशने सदानुरक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमदाक्ष जगोदर्पन्न धेय सदा पिभवग्नम विष्टदूह तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचन तम शरण्यम वेत्ताह पनतुपालीपूत वंदे महापुरुषते चरुणारिंद यत्दपल्लवनखचंदमनी छटाय विस्फुजीत कमी गोपवधुष्व दर्श पूर्णागर स्वसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयी कदा कृपा कर श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद शिवाद्वैतगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद शिवाद्वैतगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुजो कनका बुदा तो संकीर्तन कपितरो कमलाशाक्ष विशाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा भतार हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बुता थो संकीर्तन कपितरो कमलाशाक्ष विशाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा भतार हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरबंदित दीपूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दिनीम भावाूपेन्न सदा नाण गंगा तरंगरमणीय जटा कलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तो वाम भाग नारायणो प्रियमनंगमदापहारम वरानसी पुरापति भजवी शनाथम 
वागीसजुषो बदने लक्ष्मीर जस्य च भक्षसी जस्य आस्ते ही दर संभी त्वम् निशिंगम् हम भजे हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे तद्विज्ञानार्थम सौ गुरु में भावी गच्छेत समीत पानी सोचूं हम ब्रह्मनिष्ठम तद्विज्ञानार्थम सौ गुरु में भावी गच्छेत समीत पानी सोचूं हम ब्रह्मनिष्ठम गौरी और गोष्ठीपोती सिसिला भक्ति शिद्धांतो सारस्वती गुस्सा में रह पहुँचा परम परमंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड है इफ यू आर सो लॉन्ग सो लॉन्ग इफ यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू रियलाइज दैट गुरु पाठ पद्मो एंड भगवान सेम आप तू देन यू कैन नॉट चैंट हरी नाम Harinam you cannot see. When you can realize Bhagavan and my Guru Padma same, I mean Bhagavan coming in the form of Guru Padma, then and only then it is possible for you to do actual Harinam. So long as you are not going to believe that the mantra I have received from Guru Pāt Padmu is equal to Bhagavan. Till then you cannot start your bhajan. So long as you cannot realize that the mantra you have received from Bhagavan is equal to Bhagavan and also this is equal to Gurudev, till then you cannot do bhajan. Srila Jeeva Goswami was speaking, we must take shelter unto a lotus feet of such a Guru who can cut all our doubts. It is the duty of Guru Pat Padma to cut all doubts and suspicion inside our heart. Not that we can take Diksha from Guru Dev and we can go outside to third person, anybody, to cut our doubts, not that. Jiva Goswami was speaking, if Guru Padma cannot cut your doubts and suspicion, then naturally you can de develop some doubt about Guru Padma. If Guru if Gurudev cannot solve any problem which you are facing, then naturally bonded soul, they can develop some doubt about Guru Pātpada. That can make you fall down. That's why Jiva Goswami is speaking, it is more practical to take shelter of such a Guru who is Shabde Paricha Nisnatam. Shabda Brahma and Parabrahma. Shabda Brahma and Parabrahma are non-different from each other. Shabda Brahma and Parabrahma are non-different from each other. And we know from all Shastra that Parabrahma, Paratpar, Akhileshwar, Bhagavan, Sri Krishna coming in this material world in the form of Aprakita Shabda Brahma. Kali Kale Naam Rupe Krishna Avatar. You heard. So Bhagavan can come in the form of Shabda Brahma. Because Shabda Brahma and Bhagavan are non-different from each other. If my Gurudev is, you know, Parabrahma Nishnatham. Nishnatham means Shabda Paricha Nishnatham. If my Guru Padma have no direct feeling about the Seva of Bhagavan, 
if my Guru Patma no have, have no direct feeling about the seva of that Parabrahma Paratpara Krishna Bhagavan, in that case he cannot inculcate the seva mood inside me. I mean he cannot give his feeling to me. Because what I don't have, how I can give to you? What I have, that I give to you. What I have, that I give to you, give to you. What I don't have, well, how it is possible for me to give to you? It's not possible for him to give to you. That's why if my Guru Padma have no direct feeling, seva, seva feeling, direct experience of seva, seva feeling, then he cannot engage me in seva. And Shabda Brahma, also my Guru Padma can have a complete idea about Shabda Brahma. Because if Shabda Brahma, no idea about Shabda Brahma, then he cannot cut my doubts. So Jiva Goswami was speaking, both we need, otherwise there is a big problem we can face in our life. We can express doubt about our Guru Pad Padma. In that case we can fall down, big problem. Yesterday I told that Guru, that Tattabhid Guru, yesterday I told Tattavit Guru can cut the doubt of disciple very, very easily. It's, it's not a big problem. He can cut. Abhidva, Abhidva is there inside the heart of disciple. Inside the heart of disciple, there is Abhidva. So if you are approaching Sadguru, I mean, who is, you know, Tattabhid Purush, he can cut your doubt, provided you are going to take shelter in true sense, I mean surrendered. Because without surrendered, I already told, Bhagavan Sri Krishna told in Gita, three conditions should be fulfilled. Three conditions. Three conditions should be fulfilled. After that, you can achieve, you can get Tattagyan, Tattagyan from Guru Pātpat. Seva Mūt Sulya Paripanipāt Paripashno Seva. These three conditions, it is not a matter of philosophy, practically you can try. Practically you can try. Maybe you are very intelligent, you are educated, you can catch so many things. But if you have no seva mood, no serving temperament, maybe you are educated. But still you cannot realize, I mean catch all the tattva vigyan. You cannot catch. Only and only by the kripa of Guru Padmo, I mean tattva purush, we can get I mean Pranipat, 100% submission, without any duplicity, Paripeshno, self-inquiry, who am I, etc. And Seva Mood. Bhagavan Sri Krishna and Balaram, also, they also wanted to show us this kind of thing. In their Guru Kul, you can remember. So without serving temperament, somebody can hear Harikatha, but cannot catch, cannot make any improvement in his bhajan life. Not possible. So yesterday I told it is very easy for uh, for Tattabhit Purush to cut the doubt inside the heart of inside the heart of disciple who is inclined. Abhidha and Vidva I told yesterday Abhidha and Vidya both can put us in trouble. Abhidha means ignorant. Vidya is also dangerous. 
Vidya is also dangerous if you are not going to take it positive way. Usually, Vidya can cut Avidya. We know it. Favorable Vidya can cut Avidya. But, but if you are going to achieve that kind of Vidya, which is against, I mean, negative Vidya, in that case, that Vidya can put you in trouble. So, to cut Abhidva, Gurudev can help you. <laughs> but to cut Vidya, also you will have to extend your hand. If you are not going to extend your hand in front of Guru Padma, then Guru Padma cannot cut Vidya. Regarding Abhidva, Gurudev can cut. No need of your on your part, only you are 100% inclined, then Guru Padma. But for Vidya, your personal effort is also necessary here. Abhidya can take you negative way and put, I mean down. Abhidya can day by day can put you down and Vidya can take you up. Up. up doesn't mean all Vaikuntha. I am not speaking. Up. Money, you can go up. So, both way problem. One devotee don't like to be in bondage. If you go down, I mean by Abhidya, it is also bondage. By Vidya, Vidya also can bring some different motive. Vidya can also someday can bring some motive, bad motive, negative motive in your life, which can make you free from devotional field. That's why Vidya is also, yesterday I was speaking, Evam Guru Pasanaika Bhaktya, Vidya Kutareno Siteno Dhiro, Vibrisya Jiva Sayamayam Apramatto. Sangvrishya Atmanam Athutta Jyubastam. Apramatta means alert. Alert, very careful. So, in this sloka, I told you yesterday that finally, when you are going to get bhakti, before getting good, you will have to cut Abhidha also and Vidha also. Vidya can give you pra Vidya can give you can you can develop you know Papta you can develop proud. So Vidya and Avidya, like I told the case of Prabhupada. When Prabhupada wanted to approach Guru Path Padma, then he told I day that day that by the behavior and attitude of Gorkisha Babaji Maharaj, it was clear that I am not a important personality at all. By the behavior and attitude of Guru Kishore Bhaji Maharaj, it was proved that I have no quality, nothing, what all I have, education, everything, and a high caste, high birth, nice looking, I am Pandit, all useless in front of my Guru Pātpada. After that, Guru Padma wanted to provide a kick to break up my room of false ego, I told. This I already told to, to clarify this point. Now to cut with the disciple also should approach positively. Why? Because if disciple is not ready to not ready to stop providing fuel in the fire so long as disciple is not ready eh, is not ready not ready to add fuel in fire money disciple if like to put fuel in fire then the fire can go on Mentally, you have the right to think so many things, so many things you have, you are thinking so many things. 
So if you go on thinking, I mean going to provide the fuel in the fire, in your mind, I mean the object of enjoyment. Try to know what I say. You have the mood of enjoyment, but you will have to promise Gurudev, I don't need any matter, I submit. But if you reserve the right to provide fuel in the fire, what Gurudev can do? Follow. Inside fire, there's the mood of enjoyment there. So if you are going to provide fire from outside, I mean you are going to provide matter. You are going to provide matter. Then the fire can never extinguish. You can never. This way, disciple must be very careful. He should not provide fuel in fire. Always must be very careful. Otherwise, there will be a big problem. And about Guru, disciple, Bhagavan Sri Krishna told, all qualities Bhagavan speaking here, how his behavior should be, all his activities, and what is the behavior of Guru Padma, he already told here. About the activities of Guru Padma, everything. If there is no acharan, if there is no acharan in the life of Guru Pad Padmo, only he can memorize some sastra. If only Guru Pad Padmo can memorize some sastra, but no acharan. In that case, disciple cannot do any bhajan. But acharan is very powerful. Acharan is so powerful. In front of Acharansil Sadhu, in front of Acharansil Sadhu, those who are having no Acharan, they become very fearful. They, become, they feel fear. Acharan can speak itself. I have seen in my life some Sadhu there, they are not speaking a lot. Acharans in sadhu if sitting in the chair. Acharans in sadhu if sitting, not speaking anything. Not speaking any only acharan, sophisticated acharan, very powerful. All character, all acharan means devotion. Acharan means not that some, some ex extraordinary activities. Acharan means complete devotion. Whatever is doing for the complete satisfaction of Bhagavan. That is called Acharan. Acharan doesn't mean some extraordinary thing I can show. So Acharan is Sadhu, if not speaking anything, still people can feel some reaction inside heart. Acharan is Sadhu as Acharan, who is not speaking, still somebody coming in front of him can feel some reaction. Because his Acharan can speak something. His sight, his darshan, his acharan can speak something positive. Very. And those who have no acharan, if they can speak a lot of bhashan, lecture, lot of bhashan. But that, that bhashan, that lecture, cannot give any benefit to those who are hearing. And he himself also feels disgusted someday. He himself, who is passing lecture only, someday he can feel disgusted with his own lecture, monotonous, eh, useless. So, Acharan Sil Sadhu always busy with Seva. Acharan Sil Sadhu can put one impact inside your heart. Be careful, always, all the time. So, I told uh, yesterday, Achajyor Aranir Addo Shad Ante Vashi Uttar Arani Tat Sandhyanam Prabhachanam Vidya Sandhi Sukhavaha We already discussed it. Already. After that, Uddhavji Maharaj putting question. Uddhavji Maharaj asking to Bhagavan Sri Krishna. This question going on. 
how bondage condition and free condition develop. I, need, I like to know all in details about how it is happening. How it is happening? Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking to Dhabji Maharaj that usually people are busy with good activities and bad activities. Both bad, good activities and bad activities, I mean wrong activities, I mean what is sinful activities, both bad because those both ways there is bonding. Only the difference is there, Bhagavan speaking, in Veda, different kind of ritualistic act activities are mentioned there. You can do it, you can do it, you can do this also. And after that it is written, if you do it, you can get some benefit, some lucrative offer. If you do these ritualistic activities, then you can get this benefit. If you are go this way, this when this you are doing, then you can get this benefit. This way, it is one kind of motivation. Bhagavan speaking, without any motivation, nobody can do. Nobody can do. Motivation is very important thing. Motivation. So Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav, people either busy with wrong activities, I mean sinful, or good activities. Because people cannot stay neutral. People cannot stay neutral. They cannot say, I cannot do good or bad, nothing. It's <laughs> not possible. Either good or bad can do. So at least they can feel it necessary to do some ritualistic activities. Why not? So at least they can stop doing wrong activities. That's why Vedas are going to give some, some lucrative offer. If you are doing this, then you can get it. If you are doing this, you can get it. This way, different kind of lucrative offer. Like Putresh to Jagya, if you do, then you, can, you have no son, no children, so you can get his Putra. Or if you do this, Ashamed Jagga, you can cut all sinful legs, everything. This way, different kind of lucrative offers are there. But both way bondage is there. If they are going wrong way, they can fall, they can go down and down and down, fall down. They can go to hell, get some punishment there. Very painful situation and if they are doing some pious activities at least they can go to heaven and in heaven though heaven though we know heaven is not free from the influence of maya heaven is not at all free from three modes of nature but one point is that in heaven, there is a predominating factor, Satogun. That you can say. But no, you cannot say Rajagun is not there, Tamogun no. There. There, but less. And also one important, in heaven, all the time, some or other kind of ritualistic activities, they are doing Jagya, this. it is a nature. In heaven, they are always doing something. They are doing something. That is good for bonded soul. If, at, if they go to heaven, at least they can get habituated in this environment, good environment. But one dangerous thing is also there. Because there is abnormal enjoying environment. Abnormal. <clears throat> Even that kind of enjoyment you cannot expect here. In material world, enjoyment is there because this is called Devi Dham. This is called Devi Dham. Devi Dham, Devi Dham means 
Durga is Devidam, is platform is Devidam, and in Brahma Sangita you reaching the upper and upper planet you can go. Devi Mahesh Dhamma Te Shu Te Shu Te Te Prabhav Nichaya Bhihitas Chajeno in Brahma Sangita you reaching. So gradually. I already told in Brihad Bhagavad Amrita, our Gopakumar gradually going up and up. Though he likes to get the Seva Bhagavan, there is no contamination, but according to the desire of Bhagavan or according to the desire of Gurudev, he is going step by step up to show us all the picture. Otherwise, we cannot know. It is a desire of Gurudev. Otherwise, Gurudev already promised. It was a standing commitment of Gurudev, blessing of Gurudev, whatever you want, by chanting this mantra, you can get. And whenever you like to get direct participation inside the Leela of Bhagavan, that you can also do by the help of this mantra. You can look everything, all Leela of Bhagavan, by chanting this special mantra. So, we are expecting some doubt. Why Gurudev is speaking? Maybe some motive is there. Maybe some reason there. So, maybe it is a desire of Bhagavan. Otherwise, Gopkumar less interested about any enjoyment. He was many times given the post of kingship. We know Brihad Bhagavad, he was given the post of kingship, he was king, but he was not feeling happiness. That's when he is, by nature, he is niskinchan. We are sure that by nature he is niskinchan. So what is the problem if somebody going, if all Brajavas is going to give 10,000 cows to Madhavendu Puripad? Can it make any problem for Madhavendu Puripad? Or is there any problem for Prabhupada if there is countless land and properties in the name of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is there? Do you think there can be any problem? No problem. No problem. Prahlad Mahal never wanted to become king. But Nishinga Devi, okay, you have to become. But you are the representative. If you become king, then the preaching of uh, preaching will be very nice. So that is the motive of Bhagavan. Otherwise, Pollama is full detachment. He don't like to become king, he don't like to marry. This way, you should, ring, you should remember that the Gopakumar was Niskinchan by nature, but still some secret reason must be there. Otherwise, it is not possible for Gopakumar to develop some desire, well, I can go to heaven to see what is there. Why? Why? After that, you can go up. Again, you can go up. Again, you can go up. Why? Because if Gopakumar is not going to open the screen of mystery, whatever thing, what is there, I, we cannot understand. So, Gopakumar is going there one by one, stage by stage, and going to prove going to show us, oh, this is the condition there. Do you like to go there? Because we know that two types of mukti there. Mukti, so many, four types of sajujyo, sarupo, sarupo, that I am not speaking. I mean the mukti, two types of mukti, in basic. One is, directly you can get mukti. One is, Jiva Goswami writing, step by step mukti. I am not speaking mukti is two types. I am not speaking. And the mode of mukti, mode of mukti, two types. One type of mukti, you can get direct mukti after living body, sha, you can go. And another mukti, according to a desire, you can go gradual promotional mukti. This is also possible. Like we hear from Shastra that if somebody is going to leave body in Varanasi, he can get Mukti. He can get Mukti, na? 
So you like to go Varanasi, you go to Varanasi. Leaving Vrindavan, you could go. You don't know, have no idea what do you mean by mukti by there. What is, what kind of mukti you can get? In Gayadam also you can get mukti. What kind of mukti, how you can get? In Shukar Khetra, when Baraha Maharaj disappear, Baraha De Bhagavan, that also there, near Kasganj. Uh, many times when went there, there was a very small temple of Gosai Maharaj. Very small temple. I went there. It is on, it, on the Kunda. The temple is on the Kunda. I mean from Kunda, uh, from temple, you can see water there. But no urine and stool you can pass there. You have to go out of temple, long distance, there, separate, there you can go. Because it's prohibited. Follow. That is also you can get mukti. But what kind of mukti you want? It is written that in Gaya, in Shastra, it is written, if you are going to leave your body in Gaya, with positive feeling, I mean, you can get mukti. Gaya yancha stale mukti. Stale means land. And in Varanasi, water and land, both. Wherever you live body. Gaya yancha stale mukti. Varanasyam jale stale. And jale stale cha antarikhe tridha muktim cha sukare. Sukar means sukar khetra. Jo, water, land, or in space, wherever you live. Body. Now, what I wanted to say that mode of mukti basically, basically mode of mukti two types. One is gradual promotional procedure. You can go to heaven. From there, you can go again up. Bhur, bhuba, shwa, maho, yano, tapo, shatya, shatyalok also barrier. Shatyalok also big problem. From Satyalog, where you can go? From Satyalog, you will have to get, achieve more and more power to cut eh, the, you know, Viroja. And after that, you have to penetrate Viroja water. Then after crossing over Viroja, you can reach the Brahma, impersonal Brahma effulgence. You can wear light and light everywhere. Impersonal Brahma effulgent. What Bhagavan Sri Krishna told, Brahma no hi pratishta aham. I am the I am the I am the original reason of Brahma. I mean, follow. And in Brahma Sangita, what is it? Jat Brahma niskala mananta masesha bhutam. Jat Brahma niskala mananta masesha bhutam. Gavindamadi Purusham Tamam Bhajam. So Brahma effulgence is the body effulgence of Bhagavan Sri Krishna. If you can get satisfied with Brahma effulgence, okay, that's up to you. And then after that Brahma effulgence, if you like to penetrate Brahma effulgence and go more, then you can reach Shadashiv Dham. Where? Adhaita Gosha Shadashiv there. Shadashiv also by Kuntra Loka is one part. After Sadasip, if you go more up, you can get where Narayan, I mean Bhagavan Vishnu, take in different form. Vaikuntha, all Vaikuntha, Ram, Nishinga, Varaha, Kurma, Matsa, all different, different abode there. According to their mode of bhajan, devotees can go and get eternal seva there. Like the case we know in Parikrama Khanda, that one Brahman, you heard, one Brahman in Kuladeep has very much interested to worship Barahadev. All is shedding tears, Prabhu, help me. You can go to Parikamakhanda. That Barava used to worship and Barahadev appear in black, blackish body, appear and bless him. So, the, so that Brahman who was interested about Barahadev. So after getting Shiddhi, I mean living body, where you can go? You are Barahadev. Where you can go? 
you desire to reach Baraudev, so you can go to the abode of Baraudev. If you like to reach the abode of Nishingadev, you are worshipping, then where you can go? You can go there. According to your desire, no? Bhajan mode, you can get Siddhi, but that is why. So, after that, if you are not getting satisfaction, even in Vaikuntha Loka, satisfaction in the sense, satisfaction is okay, dissatisfaction, dissatisfaction not possible there, but still, you would like to get more. If I say dissatisfaction, if I say dissatisfaction is there in Vaikuntha, it's not good, because not, but still, you would like to get more and more higher thing. Then you will have to cut that, you can go up. Tadupari Golok Vrindavan, it is written in Chaitanya Jav, you see. Brahmando Bhamita Guno Bhagavan Jeev, Guru Krishna Prasade Bhai Bhakti Lata Bij, Malihaya Sevij Kare Rupon, Shoban Kitan Jale Kare Sechan, Upojiya Vare Lata, Brahmando Vedi Jai, Tadupari, but Brahmando Vedi Jai, Tadupari. Vaikuntha Lok, after that again can go Tadupuri, Golok Vrindavan, Krishna Charan, Kalpa Vikshe Karayara. So gradually you can go. So direct you can go or in gradual like our Gopaguma swaying. Gradually going up, going up. To show the mystery there, what is there. Gradually you can go there. That you can go. So, those who are interested about heavenly planet to enjoy there, they can go to heaven. I am not speaking all of them can cut, uh, you know, like Gopakuma, they can go up. No, not that. They can go up. Brahma Lok, I mean, uh, I mean, heaven, they can go. This bhu, bhu logmane, it is material world, all matter. Matter is also there in 14 world. Everywhere matter. But matter gradually taking the fine form. Here matter, oh you can taste, wood, star, there, all, blood, taste. Matter is also there, but in fine form. Not like this. If you go more up, then heaven, bhu, bhu, shor, mahalok, Janolok, Tapolok, gradually you can go. There is all, everywhere matter. But according to their degree of promotion, promotion, their matter is more fine and fine. And in Tapolok, they are less interested about enjoyment. But Tapolok, na? Tapolok when they are doing Tapa. Less, not so. But anyway, enjoyment there. If you like to, they can get. And in Brahma Loka, more fine form enjoyment. It is written in Sastra, if you go and reach Brahma Loka, you can go mad. Because time to time, every fraction of second, there is scenery changing. All. Changing. All. Everything. Oh, nice. Brahma Loka. So devotees, they don't like to get confined within this range of enjoyment. So, I told you, both ways they can go. If they like to go negative way, and if they like to positive way, they can go. But, but anyway, a devotee don't like to be confined with this range of enjoyment. They don't like to go. So, what they need? Then they need to receive such a Guru Pad Padma who can save him from this kind of material torture totally. If you can go through Gita, there you can find that Satogun is also a cause of bondage. Satogun. You are getting Satogun. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. Satogun also can bind you. Come on. If you become like to get satogun is also bondage. Sukhe bandhat. Satogun can give you some maturity 
and you can develop more and more happiness by by learning Vidya, Satogun can help you. Because those who are Satogun, usually they are not so chanchal. You can find those who are very intellectual people, very intelligent, like big, big sign. Usually they are very, they are talented. They are not so chanchal. That's when they have Satogun, predominating, predominating factor. And Satogun, if you are having Satogun, you don't like to fight with public. You can see. Those who are having Satogun, usually they are not with fighting mood. Usually they are not busy with fighting mood. They don't want to fight. Not that. Tamagun, Rajagun, they are fighting. But those who are having Satogun, predominating Satogun, usually they are not fighting. They like to lead peaceful life. You can watch. They usually they like to peaceful life. But that is also bondage. I like to lead peaceful life. Don't disturb me. What is this? Oh, don't disturb me. I like to lead peaceful life. Don't disturb me. This is also karma. This is also karma, passive karma. Otherwise, why you become interested to become, to be in peaceful condition? We devotees, we want to want to follow the track of Bhakti Mirataku, what he told, Tomar Shebai Dukhahai Yato Seyota Param Shuk. Any amount of trouble I need to meet in the way of doing your seva, I am ready. I don't feel bad. I feel very happy. Tomar Shebai Dukhahai Yato Seyota Param Shuk. I feel absolute happiness when I am going to face different kind of Problem, impediments in the way of your seva, I feel very happiness. So, this is completely separate thing. I am in the mood of devotees. I Tomorrow I can discuss why Prabhupada told to serve Paramahansa Guru, I am right to go to hell. I can discuss tomorrow. You cannot understand in this condition, in this condition, you cannot realize the heart of pure Guru Vaishnava. In this condition, I know you are not totally bondage, you are going up. But still in this condition, you cannot realize the heart of pure Guru Vaishnava. What is the mood of Seva? So both were bondage. So if Satogundya, okay Satogundya, so what? Satogundya doesn't mean he is a great devotee. Satogun is there, okay, maybe Satogun. Who care, man, Satogun? Satogun is also bondage, na. Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking. Those who are having Satogun predominating, those who are having Satogun as a predominating factor, they always like to lead a peaceful life. Very nice place, one, one bungalow, very always garden, nice actually reading room. Uh, Ah, very nice. You also have a such dream, na? Eh? Bhagavan wanted to <laughs> break your dream. Eh? I know you. I know everything. <laughs> so this way, those who are having this kind, they are, they are going. I go to Pune. When I was young, I went to Solle. Long ago, when I was a very small boy, then Salt Lake was forest. Oh, Salt Lake was forest. Or oh, jackal moving around. But now Salt Lake, you cannot get one piece of land. One piece. One centimeter land you cannot get. So costly. Hello. Near Shantipur, uh, Shantiniketan, Bolpur. Many time before I used to go through that place to go somewhere for Harikatha with devotees. I see one new, uh, new planned area. I asked one man, one gentleman was there traveling with me. What is this? Why so? I know, but uh, Maharaj, all intellectual man, oh, rich man, very rich man. 
Like Salt Lake, you know? They are making one place. Here only rich man can come. Follow. I went to Pune, near Bombay, for Harikatha. There, there the computer engineer, I mean, with our Acharya, I went there long. He took me, we can speak Harikatha there, long ago. There is, I went there. And in Pune, they take, take us to a new flat where they buy. How much cost of the flat? I heard. Oh, really? Well, aha, so costly. It's very new build area, super build area. They're making so costly, only rich men can come. And now it looks like a remote area. But everybody, those who are having car, only they can go there. So this is the way. It is there. there. But we don't like to go there. But they like to go there. They spend money, huge amount of money. It depends upon the, their logic, what they like. So, Satogun also the, can make you fall down. Satogun also can make you fall down. So, we need Shuddha Sato, pure Sato. Bhagavan speaking, if you develop Satogun, that doesn't mean Rajagun is not there. You are developing Satogun, does, that doesn't mean you are free from Rajagun and Tamagun. Not that. Some admixture is there. I mean, maybe Tamagun is very, very less. A Rajagun is a little bit. But Satogun is very, very That's why you are Satogun. But we like to go out of these three modes of nature. I mean, Sata, Raja, Tama, we don't like to be in the influence of Sata, Raja, Tama. Only we like to get Shuddha Sata. So, just now I told, those who like to develop Sata, they like to become learned man, Vidya. But it depends upon the nature of that man, what kind of Vidya. So, Vidya and Avidya both can put you in danger. So, devotee never like to be confined within this, within this range of, of problem and within this range of uh, this influence of nature. They like to go out. So, to go out, you must pray to your Gurudev. I just, I told for a long time, that by the help of Guru Padma, someday you can cut your Vidya also. Vidya also you can cut, because Vidya can put you in problem. That the same thing he told, that Vidya, Kutare, no Site, no Dhiro, a very sharp weapon, cutter, you can cut Avidya from. And after that, when finally you are successful to cut Vidya, Again, you will have to cut it, uh, throw your, the cutter. Cutter, what is the cutter? Cutter is Vidya. Cutter is Vidya, no? Sharp edge. By the help of it, I am going to cut Avidya. After that, when you are successful to cut Avidya, you will have to cut, you will have to throw this cutter, I mean Vidya also you can throw. Vidya also you can throw. If you don't throw, today or tomorrow, your, you know, sometimes some problem can be there. Some problem can be. We know in, in, the, in our, you know, Guru Maharaj's life. With Guru Maharaj we know. One learned man came. Learned in the sense, educational quality is not there. He is memorizing Shastra, sharp, sharp brain. I am not going to speak the name. A long sastra, he can memorize, he can speak so. But I never saw him busy with bhajan. Very popped up. He's educated, nice looking, from Brahmin family. I'm not going to speak any name, because name is not so important. Finally, what happens? He took initiation from Guru Maharaj. He took initiation. He took lesson from Guru Maharaj. He took sannyas from Guru Maharaj. But finally, he started feeling, I am from high family more than Guru Maharaj. 
Guru Maharaj is also Brahman, but my family race is more higher than. I saw, I saw myself. I wanted to protect him, but big problem. That Vidya, he never wanted to throw Vidya. Vidya and Abhidya, if you could, if he could, if he could throw, throw mean, personal effort you cannot do, by the mercy of Gurudev. If you could cut Abhidya and Vidya both, then you could get Parabhidya. So, Vidya and Abhidya both, we are less interested. We like to get Parabhidya, which is only possible when Gurudev is 100% satisfied with you. It's called Parabhidya. One thing very important I like to say, when your Vidya is getting maturity, 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 Vidya, getting maturity. And at the peak point of maturity, if your Vidya is going to reach, then you can discover that your Vidya is nothing but Bhakti. What I mean to say, your Vidya in full matured form, ripe form, ripe. Like one mango get ripe, very sweet. When your Vidya are going to get maturity, I mean ripe and ripe, full ripe form, ripe full. That is equal to bhakti. But when Vidya, when Vidya in green stage, green stage, not mature, that Vidya can yield some bad result, very bad result. That was the case I was based. So Vidya and Abhidya, we are less interested as a devotee, as a devotee, we are less interested about Vidya and Abhidya both. We are interested about Parabhidya, Absolute Vidya. Parabhidya, we are interested. We should remember. Now the question of Uddhavji Maharaj to Krishna Bhagavan. We, I like to know I like to know how it is happening. Bandha Mukta. I like to know the fine technology. How it is possible a bonded soul to become Bhadha and Mukta? How is possible? I like to know in all in details about this. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Udhav. Udhav, your question itself is wrong. Huh? Wrong? Why? Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, this your question is absurd. Why absurd? Baddha Mukta, I like to know all in details about Baddha and Mukta. So how you say is absurd question. Bhagavan Sri Krishna vaccine. Baddha and Mukta, both, both imaginary. Imaginary? But we are in trouble. But Bhagavan Sri Krishna, yes, that I like to speak to you. This question itself has no background. Because it is the it is the technique of Maya. It is the technique, it is the technology of Maya. How sophisticated technology of Maya. Maya like to you know put some magic spell in your life by Shata Raja Tamamud. Maya like to make you dance. You know, every bonded soul dancing. Huh? Ah. Every bonded soul dancing. Kunti Devi is speaking. Kunti Devi is speaking to Bhagavan. Nato Nato Dharo Yatha. Kunti Devi is speaking to Krishna. How people are dancing according to the gesture of Maya? They need not dance, but they are dancing. Kunti Devi is speaking. Nato Nato Dharo Yatha. In our childhood, in our childhood, we have seen. The dancing of doll, doll, you know? Ah, you are, you are, I have seen, we have seen. Doll dancing. Who is, how doll dancing, we don't know. Doll speaking, doll dancing. Actually, there is fine thread or hair by the, make of, by the help of which that doll, both of them fighting, dancing, and embracing all doll doing. <laughs> how doing? We are very small, but ah, doll. Dancing, speaking, how nice eh? it is. But it is not true. It is not true. There is somebody who is going to play, make this play. Follow. 
by the help of one string, they are fine. But in, now you cannot see no string, they are very fine. So you can see only they are dancing. So Kunti Devi is speaking the same thing. Kunti Devi is speaking the same thing, Prabhu, Nato Natru Dharu Yatha. Just like one uh, uh, drama going on, who is going to play this doll, nobody knows. But from backside, background, somebody doing this. So we are going to see this, you know, play. Natu Natu Dharu Yatha. You are playing in the role of one father in your family. I am playing the role of one sadhu in front of you. She is playing the role of one wife. Now we are all one one play. We are taking the role. According to your previous sanskar, you are playing different role. Somebody playing the role of policeman. Somebody going to play the role of, role of district magistrate. Scientists, all they are playing one one kind of role in their life. Role means that the same thing I told some days before that in infinity world there is infinity title all created by my. All created by my. Countless titles. Whatever Indra speaking, I am Indra is also title created by my. <laughs> we ever going to speak, I am scientist. Oh, you know, I am the Acharya of the temple. That temple, Maya. If it is true Acharya, then not Maya. If it is true Acharya, then not Maya. I am not going to speak. So don't try to confuse. So, Natu Natu Dharu Yatha. Everybody, after taking birth, they are supposed to play one kind of role. Somebody is going to play the role of master. Somebody is going to play the role of student. Somebody is going to play the role of thief, dacoit. Somebody playing going to play the role of policeman. So all arrangement Mahadevi. If, if no dacoit is there, if no thief there, then no need of police. Eh? I know one Poland or what country, I forget. One country. There a policeman is there. No need of policeman. But they are moving freehand. No pistol, no danda, nothing. Because their man is very peaceful. They only they are moving around. Poland. <laughs> I heard. I was laughing. This kind of country there? Ah, yes, this kind of country is also there. Very, very peaceful there. Not fighting. So no policeman. Our case, if thief is there, policeman need. If no thief, no policeman. So everybody is going to play their respective role of minister, you know, district magistrate, policeman, these are all. But if they, if they try to think deeply, they cannot think out because Maya is there. They never wanted to stop thinking that who am I? What is my real identity? They never. If so, then who can play their role? Policeman can say, no, I cannot do policeman, I can go to Himalaya and do bhajan. So Maya must be there. Due to Maya, Prakete Kyamanani, Gunu Karmai, he Abhisha. Due to Maya, everybody. If no Maya there, no internal relationship, then nobody can do. Mother cannot feed milk to boy. Oh, useless. Relation there. They are playing one one's respective role. They are feeling their own own duty to discharge. This way, all the system arranged by Mahadevi. All the whole system in the world. <laughs> Infinity world. All illusory energy, Maya. Doing this. So this way, if you think, then how you can say? Because if if you can discover your Suddha Atma, if you can discover your Suddha Atma, if you can discover your Suddha Mata, you can find no duty. The only duty you can discover that you will have to serve Bhagavan. What kind of duty? If your Atma, all the coverings are gone, all the coverings are gone, you are going to reach the final stage of your uncovered mood, final stage. 
that is called you can discover i and that is my identity i am the servant of krishna i am the sevak of krishna jive sarup hoy krishna nitya when of when your sarup become uncovered with all illusion then you can finally discover i have the only duty to discharge i have the only duty to discharge what is that duty to serve bhagwan yes or no so bhagwan speaking this your question is baseless question this question is baseless question because bondage and mukta is all arranged by maya illusory energy my illusory energy udhav all this bondage condition and mukta condition all created by maya no reality there but it looks like reality you think that you are coming from this country your name is this your identity you have the other card you have the voter card you have the pan card foolish you think so and so deeply you are so deeply you are so deeply you are thinking that your thinking i mean the root of your thinking can go deep your root of thinking na your identity is too deep rooted if you somebody like to cut you are not that then you cannot believe it is deep rooted faith this way maya devi going to play a very nice drama with everybody oh be nice drama going on all over the world this way so bhagwan sri krishna sri krishna speaking udhav actually there is no reality because there is no question of any bondage and mukta badhan mukta is also one kind of title one kind of title created by maya my maya so if you think like mayavadi they are thinking bhagwan is now in maya but is brahma in the trap of maya are brahma in the trap of maya police how bhagwan can how brahma can be in the trap of maya is possible are is they are speaking like this mayavadi speaking by the influence of maya brahma become foolish and going to expose this kind of creation jivas are all brahma jivoiv brahma na paraha aham brahma asmi tattamashi all the one one word local word one one local word they are choosing from one one chapter important chapter of gita and from chapter of you know vedanta and they like to speak those are the very chosen selected word which has have great importance but mahaprabhu speaking foolish number one those words local words is local words no but if you go up and down you can by useless how this can be the you know most important word in the whole vedanta aham brahmasmi jivai bhavam na para or foolish no but if you go through vedanta perfectly no maya there how possible brahma can be in maya eh how brahma can be in maya bhagwan sri krishna speaking udhav how you can expect that my maya you know udhav you know the satatar satarajo tamo those are the three modes of nature controlled by maya and maya is maya is my maya mama maya duratvaya bhagwan already told in gita mama maya duratvaya mama maya duratvaya you cannot cross over my maya never mama maya duratvaya impossible to cross over this maya mama maya duratvaya nobody can cross over this maya no brahma no sankar na nobody then mama maya duratvaya 
But there is one, one, one and a single procedure. Mame vaje prapadante maya metam tarantu. Those who are going to take shelter unto my lotus feet, only and they, only and only they can cross over this Maya. But directly, how you can surrender unto the lotus feet of Bhagavan? Not possible. So that means you will have to surrender unto the lotus feet of such Tattavit Mahapurush. Because directly you cannot. Mame Bhaja Prapadanta Maya. Mame Bhaja Prapadanta Maya. Who can take shelter? I cannot see you. How I can take shelter? So you can see Guru there. I am in the form of Guru. That means you can surrender unto the Lord of Jesus. Sadguru, 100% then and only then you can cross over this Maya. Otherwise, whoever you are, whatever may be your title, Acharya, these are big posts, uh, you know, 100 temples all over the world, green banana. Green banana. Green banana, three times a week. Nothing can save you. Only and only quality, 100% surrendered unto the lotus feet of Sadhguru can save me. Nothing can save me. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Uddhav, do you think my, my Maya is my Maya, Mama Maya? Maya can put me in trouble? Do you think so? Maya coming from me. So how would the possible Maya can put some impact on me? I am never influenced by Maya because Maya is my Maya. And my Maya, how my Maya can cover me? Uddha, my Maya can cover me. My consciousness, how possible? Eh? Because Bhagavan is the source of all Chetan. Bhagavan is the source of infinity Chetan. Nitto nityanam schetano schetananam eka bahunam jabidhati kaman. He said, Nitto nityanam. All nitta is the original cause of all nitta vastu. Original cause. Nitto nityanam schetano schetananam. All schetan, I am the only and only soul. Source of all chetan. So do you think my maya can cover up me? My maya? It is my maya. How is possible I can be covered with? Not possible. So if you think about bonded soul, also I like to speak the truth, that bonded soul also have no... Its bondage is imaginary. It is created by maya. I told many times, in online katha also I told. Paro opi manute anartham tatkitan chavi paddhate. Paro opi. Why you are going to be involved in Maya? But what to do? My land gone, my property gone, money gone. You have no connection your Atma. I have no connection with money, property, whatever. Lose. No connection. Many times I told. Bhagavan speaking, what is not, you are bound to believe that. What is not true, you are bound, your father, grandfather bound to believe that. That is the magic spell of Maya. Paro opi, paro opi, mannat ena. Paro is actually paravastu. Atma is paravastu, absolute. Chinmaya, but still, paro opi manote anartham. Tatkitan chavi paddhati. Also, Bhagavan speaking, just like in dream, just like in dream, when you are watching dream, sometimes you see it, it, it like, like practical. In dream, somebody fighting with me. In dream, somebody going to, I know so many such dream, people speaking to me. In Chaitanya Gauri Mart, in one temple, Calcutta temple or uh, Jagan uh, uh, or they are in uh, Chagda maybe. There are two or three cases I know. I know so many but I can no time. One devotee was fat. 
is sitting, fan going on, he is very fat, he is sitting, sleeping there, and down one devotee, uh, he is sleeping. So both of them at a time watching true dream. Follow. Upper, I mean the fat, he is watching that thief coming. Thief coming. He likes to catch him. And down, he is watching ghost coming. Ghost going to catch him. So that upper man going to fall down on ground. Money, he is staying in the bedstead. And the lower man down in ground. <laughs> upper man in bedstead, just here. And the lower man here. Yeah? See, he fall down on the, I mean the brahmachari down. He is going to catch, each of them catch. Upper man says, I, upper man speaking, I catch the thief. Down is the, oh, thief, <laughs> oh, ghost, ghost catching me. Ghost, 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 he is speaking, thief, thief, thief. When everybody coming, finally discover this kind of drama. Nothing else, it is only dream. He is watching thief, he is watching ghost. Same thing in Puri, Jagannath Puri. One cookman there, Brahman cookman, he is staying in uh, Katak. He, after Rathayatra Uber, he is giving sizable donation from everywhere. Everybody say, oh, you cook nice, take all clothes, gamcha, everything he packed. Morning time, he is supposed to go to his home. I mean, night time he is speaking, all the packing is there. Morning time he can get, take bath and go and, and catch cat train, catch train and go to his you know, home. In the meantime, night time, 12 or 1.30 or, you know, He's watching. Oh, my everything gone. I am, you know, you know, all my everything gone, shouting. Everybody coming. What happens? What happens? Get up. What happens? Oh, everything gone. My, all my property, what I, I took, money, everything gone. What gone? That? Get up. What happened? Get up. And nothing gone. The bag is there, everything there. Bag, everything there. Why are you assaulting? Oh, no. I saw one dream. One thief came and took everything from me. I, 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 how I can go to home without money? My family man waiting. This is drama. Same thing by one speaking. It is just like one dream. Not fact. And the man who is going to feel it, also by the influence of Maya. There is one kind of magic spell there. Like in, in magic, you know? Magic, you know? One girl sleeping in, in a bed. And the magician coming, going to cut into pieces, two pieces, and the girl, head portion going this way, and this portion going that way. How possible, no? Everybody is done. How possible? Half portion gone this way. I mean, totally is a... But if you, if you think so, that magician going to cut the girl really, then policeman can come and take him. He cannot show magic exhibition to earn money. This is the case. Those who are Tattavit Purush, real Vaishnav, no ghost can catch them, no tantra, mantra, many times. We have seen, for pure devotees, some wicked men, they are doing tantra, mantra to make them sick, they cannot do. They try their best, but they cannot do. Because they are protected by Balaji Maharaj. If you try to do some problem with them, the Balaji Maharaj can destroy them. You don't know, you think you have money. You can try to do. I challenge you in front of Bhagavad. You try to do. You try to do and show me. Immediately you can get destroyed. Destroyed, full. There is a condition. So, somebody like to put pure devotees in trouble by Tantra, Mantra. There are so many procedures. At present, it's a dirty condition. Dirty condition. All over. Only if you like the horse. Like the horse, you know, Prabhupada told, like the horse, if you are putting some, only you can see the way, then you can save. 
within coming three, four years, whatever happening now, everything happening, all secretly. All in society, in fighting, they are killing each other. Policemen not coming because they pay money to police. Everything happening. But within four years, you can see dangerous situation. Within four, five years, you can see. If you are not alert right now to do bhajan, then you cannot do. To protect yourself, try to develop your bhajan power right from now. If not, then you are going to put yourself in trouble. <coughs> Tomorrow I can discuss all in details how happening and how bondage and already I told today, but still tomorrow I can discuss all in details about this. So Tad Bigyanartham Sha Guru Mevabigachet Shamitopani Sotyam Brahmanishtam Shabde Parichanishnatam Brahmani Upasamasrayam. Follow. You have to approach this can. So Bancha Kalpadru Sikh Basind Bhavicha. Patitanang Pavane Bho Vishnu Pyo Namo. Hari Bo, 